Hey guys, you're Dolis. This is Kyle Reddish. I'm here with first place winner of Baton Rouge, Louisiana KMC, Russell Coker, also known as Cullis. Uh, this guy rode down with me from Dallas, Fort Worth. Couldn't be more proud of you, brother. Uh, I got you a free travel to Seattle. Uh, you're going to be able to, to design a card, hopefully. Get you for two cents in. Stuff like that. So, but you won with a very interesting Kalima build. How many cards is this? <laughs> this is like 53. 53 cards. Yeah, We're gonna go over each one. Okay. <laughs> so I'm sure people have questions. I guess we can get these two out of the way. These are just standard removal. Okay. Uh, bone blade standard removal. Yeah, it's just really good. Okay. Same with Terrapin. Let's, let's go this way and then kind of. Okay. Uh, three mesmerize. Yeah, three mesmerize. Look at, your, look at your opponent's hand, get this card a card. Yeah, that's really good. Uh, you, in the finals, you put a skull shatter down when you should have played it. Yeah. Then you were able to, to get this and, and basically steal up the game. That's uh, pretty good. And I don't, I don't know if they've seen this yet, but I played. Yeah. If you see the match versus, what was it? Hey Bear? I played. I opened with three Mesmerites. Mm, it's it's brutal. Good. And a 53, 50, 53. 53 card deck. Uh, <laughs> two Soul Vortex. Two Soul Vortex. Uh, get back all the little blockers and uh, screeching just in case, but you really don't need it. And it banishes and is really good against Rush. Yes. A lot of times it saved me in a lot of positions where I got back my Dream Pirate or a, Skeeter or a Grudge Weaver. Get rid right of a little dude, grab, grab one of your pirates back. Yeah, really good. Uh, Santa removal, three tear pit. Yeah. That works really good with Kalima, stuff like that. Yeah. Three Dream Pirates. Oh. Shout outs to M.W. Perry. Oh, yeah. Sexy Dream Pirate. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Uh, how good were these for you today? Oh, they were really good. Oh, right. way better than. I don't know what that other thing is. Scared Orbo Gloom Hall? Yeah. I don't know what that is, but this guy's awesome. Yeah. He blocks uh, Falcora for days. Um, and he trades with That's a lot of things. That's true. That's very true. And he, blo and he trades with a lot of like 3Ks and stuff like that. A lot of stuff. Yeah. Absolutely. Two Screeching Scaredo? Yeah. Uh, Scamp is a real card, uh, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, two Skeeter Swarmer? Two Skeeter Swarmer, a uh, 4K blocker, uh, just in case I ran into like a, uh, what is uh, it? Is, um, the two for 4K green red creature? I don't remember his name. Two for 4 Oh, you mean uh, Razor, Razor, Cat. Razor, Razor Cat. Cat. Yeah, basically just for, Razor Cat. just for Razor Cat and anything under. And the laws, too, if they want to swing in. True. If they really True. want to. Uh, Grudge Weaver? Uh, Grudge Weaver, um... Combos really well with Rip Reaper and uh, uh, scares Rush into not attacking. Yeah, another another good target for Soul Vortex. Oh, of course. Three three queens. Heard yeah. good. Oh, I heard it was really good. <laughs> it was, yeah, it's awesome. Killed a lot of things. Uh, got didn't get back much. It just really ended the game. Yeah. Immediately when I played it, really. I, I, I like the ability to reanimate another one. Oh yeah. It's pretty, that, pretty close. Actually, that happened. Yeah. <laughs> Before this match, Ripper Reaper. I kept seeing you do this when they had like a single Andromeda out. Yeah, like that. <laughs> I'd uh, I'd uh, Ripper Reaper just like to kill certain things. Like in the rush matchup, I like always had like zero shields, but I like draw Ripper Reapers and like get blockers and just like keep Ripper Reaping and kill their guys. And then drop Kalima or Infernus, well mostly Infernus, okay. and just do that stuff. Uh, I think you're one of the best players as far as uh, using Reaping so. <laughs> Very, very good for you. I'm very, uh, actually game one of this game, of the finals and the game before that, I was really greedy in the first game and played too many Reaping Cells and put down Bone Blades. I can admit to that, but uh, Reaping Cells has just been helping me out most of the time. Yeah. yeah. Wow, there's only two Tendril Grasp in here. Yeah. Wow. One of those, in my opinion, won you the finals. Uh, I'm going to watch it again. One's getting really cased. Think. I don't remember which one. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it, getting uh, rid of three cyber scamps, not giving him a, a, another one, obviously. Yeah, um, you did ramp the heck out of him, but he was only he was top decking at that point. Yeah, um, and killed Hay Bears birds also, and a lot of other rush matchups really helped out. I agree. Yeah, I, I agree. Um, let's see. We got uh, Infernus. Um, probably actually almost better than Kalima because there was so much rush in this in this meta. So yeah. that's pretty much what I always went to turn nine. I, I know you went to three games in the quarterfinals, but I think this this definitely did really good stuff for you. Mm -hmm. um, tw two tornado flame. Two tornado flame. Yeah. Uh, just all the five Ks. I mean, there's a lot of awkward five for five Ks out there, but this one, but uh, there's a lot less than that also. So great against Gila Flame. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's amazing against Gila Flame. Yeah. Uh, three sprout. 
Who's the help? Um, mainly green mana because I only cast it once this whole entire tournament. But uh, it was good the first time I cast it because I got a, like a turn six. Shape blaze? Oh, shape blaze. Oh, well. I guess that goes back to like the beginning of this deck when I was made. What I really wanted to do with this deck was just like play Shade Blaze, play Kalima, break all their shields. That's basically the idea. But Shade Blaze is like a whole lot more than that. It just gets rid of their scam, go in for another guy, like give this guy enough for it to trade with one of my little blockers or like a Skak the Stinger or something like that. And just giving everything haste is just insane. I agree. I agree. Um, let's talk about Skak. Skak? Oh, just uh, ramps you to turn eight a bit faster. If it's before then, it just gets you way, way ahead than they are. And they have to discard a card. It's all around good value. Absolutely. All the six for threes are mainly good value. Mainly. Boop Striker? Boop Striker? I, I actually wanted a Slayer because, like, uh, it, it made things awkward for a lot of like people who play big stuff, like like Haven or something. I didn't play any Havens. Then, for, thank goodness. Yeah, I did. I didn't see a lot of Havens out. But. Yeah, there wasn't. Uh, but this traded with like uh, like if he had like if his li if his uh, Andromeda was tapped or something, I would just trade with him and, and it would go to my mana. I'd probably get Inferno or Quinkling off. Then. Let's talk about some of the single miser cards you have. <laughs> these, these one ofs. Uh, suffocate. Suffocate, okay. uh, just another Tendril Grasp, really. It was like one of those other outs that I was thinking about when I when you had those three scamps out. Mm. Uh, but yeah, it's like it's just another Tendril Grasp, but it also lets me trade over some guys if I hard cast it, which never happens. Darker turn? Uh, darker turn. I always tech it in control deck. It's always good in my control decks. So can give you a fourth Kalima, a fourth whatever, fourth, a third whatever. It's just always good. Get Understood. back a blocker, Ethan. Wow, you only had one copy of Skull Shatter. Yep. <laughs> One copy, especially one man. Yes. I figured I had a lot of discard in here, so I was like, I, I think I just need these two tech. We're gonna talk about the Necros last. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, wow, that's only one reinforce. Yeah, one reinforce. I saw you cast that so many times. I drew three cards, drew two cards, drew one card once, but it, they all mattered. It's like true. It, all the three cards just was insane. I just like dropped everything. It's it's actually such an insane card in this deck. Now, when I saw your deck list last night. Uh, I was like, foul mana? Really? Yeah. And you're like, it's pretty good. Mana fodder, kill their uh, good against rush, uh, make your guys trade for it, uh, good ramp. Pretty alright. Uh, I agree. Probably be the only extra card I could cut, but that's it. Okay. Single copy of Gigglehorn Charger? Yeah, it's just like, tutor for your best cards in the deck, so... Uh, what else can I say? Uh, actually, the game before the finals, I had 15 mana and I Gigahorn Charger, a Kalima, and played it. I ended up losing that game, but it was really awesome. <laughs> I agree. I agree. <laughs> now, uh, speaking of, of like value and fun stuff and craziness, oh, God. you didn't actually own a copy of Necro's Nightmare Bloom before this, uh, before yesterday. Is that correct? Yeah, before yesterday. You were able to, able, able to, to pick up a copy, yeah. add it in your deck. Yeah. How good was it for you today? Just really good. Just like really, really good. Like I just pick up like a Kalima or an Inferno or a Shade Blaze uh, most of the time when I did it. And then I'd play like Screeching or Rip Reaper or Dream Pirate or Group Striker. And but oh, and a lot and against Rush I could probably just like necro up back a a Skeeter Stormer or one of the blockers and just uh, kill their guy, uh, set down the blocker and I just have a, a free three count sitting on the field. I, I, I was blown away by it. I can't wait to go back and look at all the footage for this amazing 53 card Kalima build? Yeah, Kalima Kalima Kalima. Kalima. Junk Kalima. That's right, the deck list says oh Junk Kalima. Kalima. Or uh, Kalima 53, I guess. Kalima 53? <laughs> That's crazy. Well, congratulations again. You won your Civ. You won travel to Seattle. Um, couldn't be more proud of you, brother. I'm glad I'm glad you made the trip with us. Um, and uh, is, that all you, is that all we got? I think we're good? Yep, that's all we got. All right, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this deck profile. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. As always, from uh, everybody here in Louisiana, Peach. <laughs>